My name is Delana Hewitt. I'm an 11th grader at ECOT. I've been there for four years. I've now played in about 150 tournaments. I recently just came back from Japan, but I've been to Canada, Costa Rica, Mexico, Peru, and also Dominican Republic. I like being able to represent USA when I go out of the country. Right now I have a pretty high junior ranking. It's in the top 100. So internationally, it's really tough to get professional points and that would be my next goal. My academic goals are to graduate high school with good grades and I want to pick a school that has high academic standards and a great tennis team, so. Uh, we had some people tell us that, you know, you might have something there. But she played well enough that we had people from the outside notice and she got invited to a top 10 and unders uh, tournament out, I want to say in Columbus. Mm -hmm. And that mm -hmm. was, that. I think that's what said, okay, well, she is probably one of the top 10, 10 and under players. Well, the next, next immediate goals for Delana is she's heading down to Florida uh, next week. And uh, then from there, she's going to be heading to Mexico to play another couple of events. Um, beyond that, you know, she obviously has uh, large aspirations for the sport, you know, um, wants to play at a professional level, uh, which... Uh, she's more than capable of doing um, and so I'm looking forward to uh, following her successes in the future. ECOT has been amazing. They've been really flexible with all their times and I have to travel a lot and I'm really busy with all my practices so I don't think I would be able to compete in the international tournaments that I do and I travel so much I don't think I could do it without ECOT. ECOT's been a godsend. Yes. Like I said, the people make ECOT the best place for Delena and the best place for us. And with her development, her traveling all over the world now, she wouldn't be able to do it if ECOT wasn't around. Yeah. I agree.